you like my outfit even more. I even added a bandana to it. Gangsta. Now you're out to slay your day. You're either at work, running some errands, or even at the gym, pumping those puppies. Though the afternoon can be dangerous for our well-being. Either stress at work, rushing around too much, or even putting way too much pressure on ourselves. I have an afternoon routine to help protect my well-being throughout the day. So here they are, my five habits for my minimalist afternoon routine. Number one, meditate for three to five minutes. Now you might be saying, we already did that. Well, you know, during the day you have your clients, your coworkers, or other peeps all up in your grill and you need a time out. And the only place that we can truly be alone is in our heads. Delving back into that obsidian abyss. Delving back into the obsidian abyss. It sounds like a Witcher episode. Witcher. Not really, but whatever. I love the show. Meditating sitting on the floor or in a chair is kind of like a do not disturb sign for your coworkers. If the room is rocking, don't come a knocking. Well, it is rocking, but you're inside your head alone. If I have to do this, I'll do this before eating lunch. So just sitting back and relaxing just for a few minutes will put you back on track, Jack. So just do it, do it, do it. Number two, don't drink coffee or tea after 2 p.m. Yo, my mornings are always lit because I usually have two to three cups of either coffee or tea. But I have to say, coming down from that bus is kind of hard when you're pounding back more during the afternoon. Yo, I really want to just chillax later, bro. So what I've done is that I've limited my coffee or stopped drinking coffee or tea after 2 p.m. Something that we can do is if we can't live without our coffee or tea is that we can get a decaffeinated one or just an herbal tea. So let's slow our roll with these hot caffeinated beverages so that our descent back to earth is a smooth one. Number three, standing up at work. Now I read an article, which I will post in the description section below. In the article, it suggests for every hour that we're sitting, we should stand up for 15 to 30 minutes. It will help reduce our neck, shoulder, and back pains. And apparently it helps burn some calories, which we all love. If you don't believe me, another article is listed below. So after hearing that, I did adopt the habit and I even took it a little further. I actually bought myself a standing desk. So pretty much for the whole entire day, I'm standing. And it's super practical because first of all, I don't have a lot of space. Remember, I'm a minimalist. Minimalism. And what I love about it is that it's something I could set up in the day and then take down at night. Now we don't have to spend our cash money for a standing desk if we just simply remember to get up often. But I do have a trick in habit number five that might help us out. Ooh, I love tricks. Number four, checking my posture. Now, I put this in the afternoon routine, but we shouldn't be doing it all the time. But it's something that I've struggled with. I'm constantly hunched over, either standing or sitting. Sometimes I feel like I should be ringing the bell at the cathedral in Notre Dame. Bing bong, bing bong. So in the afternoon, I'm always checking my posture. Now, there are many tips out there on how to correct your posture, but I did get one piece of advice from a chiropractor. It was just one simple check that I had to do, which was to make sure that my sternum or the center of my body was just lifted up. I didn't have to force it. All I had to do was just be mindful to just lift it up and everything else would align. Though if you want to know the steps on how to have proper posture, I'm going to link an article below. And finally, numero 5, the 20-20-20 rule. I want to protect my eyes because I had laser eye surgery. Unfortunately, we're glued to screens, either our work computer, home television, or even our smartphone. Now, I want to keep my peepers in check, and I discovered the 20-20-20 rule. Is that three 20s? 20-20-20 rule. This rule is to help protect your eyes. It states that if you are staring at a screen for 20 minutes, after 20 minutes, you should look away for 20 seconds and look at something that's 20 feet away. This rule helps protect our eyes by helping them relax and also rehydrate them because when we're looking at screens, we blink less. So that tip I was gonna share, well, here it is. I downloaded an app called the iCare 202020 to help me with this rule. Basically, it's a timer. So you set it up, you hit start, and what it does, is it counts down 20 seconds. So you have that 20 seconds to look at something that's 20 feet away. When it sounds, then you can go back to work for 20 minutes. It will do the countdown for 20 minutes and then sound again for you to look away again. And the beauty of this app, it can remind you to stand up at your desk. Ooh, so efficient. So come on now, let's reduce the stress on our eyes and keep those peepers healthy.
So there are my five habits that I've adopted for my minimalist afternoon routine. So I hope you enjoyed that video and picked up a few ideas how to better your afternoon. Now stay tuned for my minimalist evening routine, habits that I use to slow my roll down so I can max and relax. I want to thank you for watching and have a great day. Bye.